Hello there, welcome back. In this video lecture, we'll see how to write the contents of a data frame into Hive table. In our previous video lecture also, we have seen uh, how to write a data frame uh, into a uh, Hive table, but uh, uh, using a save as a table method. In this, in this video, we'll see uh, how to use insert into uh, method, which is another method which is available for writing the contents of a data frame into Hive table. And we'll also see what are the uh, what what is the difference between a save as table as well as insert into. Uh, let me create a Spark object insert into example. And I uh, forgot ex uh, extends app. Now uh, let me create a Spark session. Now have my Spark session ready. Now let me uh, load a CSV file which is available in my HDFS location. Uh, so if I go to my HDFS location, there is something called uh, movie dot movie dot which is available in uh, movie lens uh, directory. So to create a data frame, I will create a data frame as movies, and I'll use park dot read dot, and I'm reading a CSV file. So I'll read something as option, and I'll mention header as true. These are all the usual stuff. Uh, to load uh, a CSV file and uh, I'll uh, use info schema and I'll set as true. Now I'll read the CSV file as this one, right? Now I have the CSV file ready. Now to write the contents of this uh, uh, DD data frame uh, movies, earlier we have used a method. Uh, called uh, write movies or data frame dot write dot save as table right and we used to give uh, a table name where we have to write the data frame contents uh, into which table we want to write it we'll, we used to mention that name but in this method in this video we'll see a method called insert into uh, and we have to give a table name right uh, insert into is another method uh, which is used for writing the contents of a data frame into a hive table right uh, now uh, let's uh, earlier method we have uh, earlier uh, we have used a hive uh, spark underscore courses i guess that is the database which you used yeah this is the database which we have used earlier uh, so under this database itself i would like to create a data, uh, table called movies uh, so let's uh, see if I do this way uh, whether this works or not. Let me just quickly run this uh, Spark job. Now you can see uh, the Spark job has failed, uh, stating the table of view not found. Right. So when you are using insert into method, uh, you are supposed to uh, write the data into a table which is already uh, created in Hive. That is, uh, when you use insert into method, uh, Spark will not create a Hive table for you. Rather, it uses the existing Hive table and uh, dumps the data into that particular Hive table, right? So this is the major difference between insert into and save as table. When you use save as, save as table, uh, Spark will create a uh, table based on the data frame uh, contents and the data types uh, in the Hive. But whereas if you use this insert into table, uh, insert into it won't create any uh, table for you. It tries to uh, find the existing table which is provided as a name as here and it will try, uh, try to dump the data of this movies or of this uh, data frame into that uh, uh, table, right? Uh, so we don't have uh, that uh, table ready. So let's try to create the table. I'll use uh, Spark course and I'll see create table movies uh, how many content what are the contents uh, there are three columns available movie id title and genre so i'll use movie id as uh, integer title as string and john john as string and i uh, Store, it will be stored as park table and let's see the table it's created and uh, show create table 
and you can see it is created as a packet type right now let's uh, try to run this uh, uh, data and run, run this job and see whether we'll be able to write the data or not now you can see uh, the job is completed successfully and let's see if the data has been populated into the table so show tables i have created this table right so select star from this table and i'll limit it to 10 let's see if the data is there and uh, you can see the data is uh, available there right and uh, there is one more difference between save as table and uh, insert into that is uh, when you are using insert into it follows the order whatever is there in the data frame right uh, suppose if the data frame contains uh, uh, right now the current order of the data frame is same as uh, the, the table order right the table order is uh, the table order is movie id title and genre and the data frame uh, order is also the same thing uh, uh, so that is the reason we will not have any issue over here suppose if the order of uh, the data frame is different from the order of uh, uh, the table uh, then let's see what 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 happens over here uh, it 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 will the whether it will fail or whether it will uh, throw an exception or how it uh, uh, works let's let's see that I'll just use uh, save mode as overwrite uh, just to make sure uh, uh, I am not duplicating anything. And uh, what what I'll do? I have this movies right. Uh, this movies dot select. Mm, how I'll do? Otherwise, I'll do one more thing. Uh, movies dot create uh, temp create or replace temp view. That means I'm creating a temporary table. Temp movies, right? This is my table. So from this, what I'll do, uh, what movies, right? Uh, now I have this. Uh, so what I'll do now is park dot SQL. In that, uh, what I'll do, I'll use select. Uh, the, the order of uh, the order of the data is something like this which is uh, movie id title and genre right so what i'll do uh, i'll select movie id genre and title i'll do uh, movie select movie id uh, it's movie id genre genres and uh, title from uh, temp movies so uh, this will create a uh, get the data frame temp uh, data frame right I'll just create the temp data frame now I'll write this contents of the temp data frame into this uh, table right so what I'm doing here so what I'm trying to do here uh, I'm reading the CSV file and I'm changing the order of the select process uh, that order uh, when we read the CSV file the order would be as per the order of the CSV file the CSV file has the order as movie ID title and genres but whereas I'm um, saving this uh, uh, CSV file as a temp table from temp table I'm using a select statement this select statement uh, what I'm trying to do I'm changing the order of the columns right by uh, selecting first as a movie ID and second I'm selecting as John's uh, genres and the third I'm selecting as a title uh, from this temp table so the order whatever we get in this data frame will be different from the order which is there in the movies table now I'll try to write the data into uh, the spark uh, into the hype table and see how it works theoretically whenever we change the order right it, um, uh, spark won't check the column name and uh, try to insert the data into the table but uh, it, it straight away takes the content whatever is there in the data frame and uh, uh, saves it uh, when we are using insert into statement so that's what we are trying to prove over here let's quickly see that now our job uh, is completed and uh, we don't we did not get any uh, exceptions uh, let's see how the data has been stored here uh, so i'll just give select star from movies with limit of 10 and now you can see 
um, the order as the first the movie id is saved as a movie id but the second one uh, as per the table description the second column is movie title right in under the title we are uh, uh, the data is being stored as a genre because we have selected uh, genre as the second column from our uh, temp table right global temp view uh, so if you are not uh, familiar with this uh, uh, how what what is this uh, create or replace uh, temp view uh, i'll just uh, leave an uh, uh, link to this uh, uh, video which i have uh, created on the uh, global uh, temp view or in the i button you can go and check it out uh, so as I have changed the order, uh, Spark has blindly dumped the data, whatever is there in my data frame, uh, which is dumped DF uh, uh, with the altered columns and uh, it uh, tried to dump the data. It will not match the column name and the data, whatever is there. It straight away dumps the data. So that is another main uh, uh, difference between uh, save uh, uh, save as table and insert into so insert into won't uh, ins uh, for insert in for using insert into we should have the hive table uh, created already and uh, the order of the columns uh, which uh, order of the hive table columns uh, should match with the order of the data frame columns otherwise the data consistency will not be there data data will be inconsistent right now uh, these two are uh, string uh, columns so when i uh, try to dump the data uh, it didn't throw any error it just swapped the data let's quickly try to see uh, what happens if i uh, swap the columns with uh, integer and the string right the movie id is integer and the title is string right i'll try to uh, change the order with this uh, uh, thing let's uh, see what happens here title movie id title movie id uh, and uh, genre and uh, class we do should not no need of having title over here right so right now i am changing integer and string columns and uh, see if uh, uh, the spark throws any exception or uh, how how it uh, uh, deals with this situation now you can see even in this situation uh, spark did not throw any error and uh, let's see how the data is uh, stored uh, in the table and you can see the data as uh, the uh, integer column we are trying to store as a uh, string uh, uh, spark reads that as a null and it populated entire column as null whereas this uh, second column movie title is a string uh, so it, it can easily accept uh, the numeric data types right you can see this is the difference between uh, insert into insert into never throws any error when you are trying to uh, when the columns are interchange or when the data types of the columns are not matching right so you have to be very careful when you are using insert into uh, method and you have to make sure the column the order of the column in the data frame matches the order of the uh, columns in the hype table right so this is very important uh, thing which you have to remember when you are working with uh, 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 spark uh, uh, data frames uh, that's it for this video lecture guys and uh, if you are new to the channel uh, please do subscribe and if you have uh, liked this video please uh, share the video uh, and uh, spread the knowledge okay see you in the next video bye